Hitchens scrubs low. Oh, he scrubs into the finish. Jackson Goldstone, will he do it? I think he may, he does. With a 357.2, goes into the number one spot. An explosive one run for one of the most explosive riders we've seen in a long time. How was that? You come and just beat all the Aussies on home ground. How does that feel? Oh, yeah, that felt, I mean, really cool. It's pretty stacked field out here. It wasn't just Aussies, so, you know, I'm still trying to do the best I can, and that was a, that was definitely it. That was it? I, I think I left everything out on that track, and I think I could go faster, but, yeah, I'm still panting, and it was, what, <laughs> 10 minutes ago is when I came down, so that's hard work. This, tra this track's no joke. I was going to say, do you reckon it's like, kind of like the Aussie Fort William in a way? Yeah, but I'd almost say it's harder than Fort William because it's more pedaling. Yeah. So you're just like, you're way more bonked. I feel like Fort William's harder on the hands and arms, but that, uh, that hurts. Sure. Oh. How's this? You've done, was well, this your second proper elite race and you've won both of them so far? <laughs> yeah. What a hard line of this. Stoked for the, stoked for the good start to 2023. That's all I could ask for. Sick. And now you're going home after this or back to New Zealand? Uh, back to New Zealand for a little bit and then uh, home in a few weeks, but sure. I'm going to try and just try and catch as much summer as I can before, uh, before going home. Is it snowing back where you are at the moment? Yeah, I just snowed an extra like few inches yesterday, so Sick. I'd much rather be in this weather. <laughs> and you just live in the dream. I like when I watch you ride now, I feel like you're just probably one of the only people. Not the only people, but you're probably having the most fun on your bike. And it definitely like shows your results. Is that like what you're just trying to channel? Just like having fun and just enjoying it. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I mean that's what it's all about. It's just having fun to me. And uh, you know, I really enjoy going fast on my bike and I'm glad uh glad it turned out that way. Nah sick. Nah, appreciate it. Cheers, man. <laughs> Rem dog. Dino. What have we done, mate? You're looking a bit beat up. Yeah, I had a bit of a big crash then and smoked my head. Um just came out of the bunny walk section and tipped her over. Um You feeling alright though? Yeah, I'm all good. I was on a pretty good run, I was going for it and then I started like thinking a bit too much yeah. and had a few mistakes and then whenever I do that I crash. So. Yeah, you go in your own head a little bit. Yeah, I was like, oh don't fuck it up. <laughs> and, then, you know, and then you fuck it up, yeah. yeah. But you know the speed's there though, you got the speed. Yeah, the speed's there so it should be a good season, yeah. looking forward to it but... You guys yeah. are pushing each other? Yeah, yeah. for sure, yeah. <laughs> so you got, you got the national champ. Yeah. You'd be pretty pumped with that. That's all I was chasing. I couldn't give a shit if Jackson beat me, to be honest. You got the national champ, yeah. yeah. No, um, I'm pumped. You were the pick for me. I said yeah. it was going to be between you and Troy, and I think, what, Troy got third? Yeah, yeah. thank you, man. Yeah, I was, um, yeah, super stoked. Because no. you're training hard at the moment. You're, just, you're, you're hungry for it, hey? Yeah, yeah, yeah. for sure. So, no. couldn't be happier. Are you going to do many more? Are you going to do EWS or anything coming up? In yeah, time? doing the next EWS, the two in Tassie, yeah. yeah so, heading to Tassie after this yeah I think yeah that's a good start with the team as well like yeah. new team you start everything yeah it's good so yeah. Good. Yeah. yeah loving the bike it's, it's awesome everything's working what are your goals yeah. this year what are you like get the podium just... yeah podium consistent top 10 if I can I think it's my goal yeah um, yeah see what happens but I'm um, yeah feeling best ever have on my bike so yeah. excited nah it's good to see man all the training and everything you're doing it's just like it's motivating see like Aussies pushing themselves and getting that like hunger and going for it yeah thank you yeah, yeah. It's, it's good what are you looking forward to most this year though like what track or race is there one in particular you're like getting keen for uh not really just take as it comes i guess but uh um yeah i mean there's lots of awesome tracks uh i feel like the more physical ones suit me usually so um but yeah uh just super excited for the season no nah, looking forward to it thank All you right, well, congrats man cheers dino hey. <laughs> Kai Hearn, Kai Hearn, mate. How's it going? You, you said you were going to lay one down and you did. I'm stoked, bro. Gave everything to it. I laid it all out there. No complaints from me. No mistakes. I pushed hard. I gave them all. Came out fourth, so I feel like most of those dudes, that's World Cup podium, so... I'll take that, bro. I'll take oh, that. That's a, that's a stacked field as well. Like, there's a lot of internationals here, and like, to lay it down, that's that's all. Yeah, bro. Four minutes of racing, and we're just so close to each other. So, no, I'm stoked. I'm happy. Happy to come out alive and be uh, be on the pace still after the ankle. So, I'm yeah. stoked. And how was that with the crowd? Like the whole way. I've never seen a crowd so loud the whole way down Threadbow. That was epic. Dude, I came into the shoot. I sat down for a sec to compose, and I just saw people everywhere. And I was just like, yeah. <laughs> so sick. Even in Bunny Walk, man. Even coming into. 
Donnie walk, I was like so shocked because normally it's quiet after the shoot, and then the whole way I was just getting cheers. It was epic. Dude, I've never seen that many people, so thanks everyone for coming out. That makes it so sick. Yeah. Make, it makes our day when we see that many people, eh? Yeah. I love it. And live feed as well on TV. Look at all the groms around. It's the, the sport is alive. The sport is alive. Daniel's never been more alive, folks. And what's the plan now? Are you hanging around in Oz for a little bit before going OS? No, I actually fly out on Wednesday, so in three days I go to Queenstown, uh, so just New Zealand for a bit over a month and do some summer series stuff and uh, a bit of testing with the team and uh, Crankworx Rotorua. So straight off there, get some more stuff settled for the season and uh, ride some more bikes. How can you complain? Are you coming back here before you go to World Cups or are you just going straight from there? No, I'll definitely come back. So I go there for a bit over a month and then come home for a few more months and then late start in June. So yeah, sick. should be good. Are you going to race the Enduro in Tassie at all? No, I'm going to be over in New Zealand. Oh, you'll be in New Zealand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I wish I could. Wanted to get the Hurt Locker, you know, <laughs> go up against Timmy Eaton, see how salty the dog really is. <laughs> It doesn't matter if you win or lose, it's just if you beat Timmy Eaton. <laughs> That's the bar. I don't know, did you beat you obviously beat him today? I don't know if I beat him, but yeah, I'll I take the stats. No, I went yet. Yeah, so, nah, Alright, good job man. Thanks bro. <laughs> yeah, 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 we'll go, we'll do uh, that. We'll hold this down, down here. Yeah. 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 We're doing the double Yeah. Kevin Bakewell, do you want to swap the hands or do you want to try by curse or? I broke it last year, man. I got on the podium, remember? Oh, and I said I was never gonna come back. Well I was gonna come back, just not just, just not ride. And then they made it national champs. So I was like, so well, you I, had to. I had to come back. You had no choice. Dude, I was at the top of the hill in the start gate. I had this little moment where I was like, I've got to enjoy this because this is probably the last cannibal race I'm ever gonna do, eh? <laughs> I will come back, I will come back. But Just with the mic. With the mic, with yeah. the mic and the camera. Well, bro. I've we'll got be the... trackside, you and me well, can be trackside. I'm trying to break the Cannonball curse next year in race, so maybe we can swap. <laughs> we can swap. We'll see. Okay, I'll, if you want to hire me out for Moi Moi TV, me and, uh, me and Purdy can come tap Hell in. yeah. What do you charge? Oh, mate, for you, we'll, we'll do your deal, we'll do yeah, your deal. Yeah, okay, we're doing our deal. I, I, want, I reckon you and me should be at the Dodham, just like in a big booth, like, you know, like yeah. dodgeball. I think we should do that. Get up, we could pitch that. Um, what's on for the night, mate? Well, I think we're going to go up, talk to people to whip off, try and really yeah. pump people up, you know, push I'm people to go home. Um, chasing a, a whip off send. The yeah. whip off video last year was hectic. Yeah, we're going to go walk around. That was like around. 10 flatlands. We're going to go for flatland again. <laughs> nah, I, was, I flatlanded in my race. No, you did on purpose. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nah, that wasn't deliberate. <laughs> okay. I, I break check and scrub. Was it a tailwind? I don't know, man. Because people, know, some people were casing it and some people were just sending it flat. You must have been on your way up. But, but like when we went to start watching racing, some dude just got laid out. No, I just missed it. Yeah, oh, yeah, it's yeah. Grim. Now all the under 17s went to flat. Yeah. Literally, they just like don't know how to brake check or scrub. Yeah, because you haven't learned to scrub yet, eh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like excited for this year, new team, mate, new sponsors. I'm excited for this year. Just fresh start. Just going, bit of going a in. Shitty way to start. That's all right, mate. You're apart gonna, from that, I'm very excited. You're gonna be ready for Tassie, though. We did a team camp. The team's sick. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna have everything we need. So I just need. To <laughs> I asked Yarn how. Um, how excited she was about being teammates with you and she's like he's a weapon but I love it <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah Sean on that note Sean outbenched us all in the gym so. really her new name's Shani Shani, Shani Schwarzenegger <laughs> <laughs> yeah well, I think you'll be happy to know this as well wow. I got a wild card entry for Derby so yeah so, one, one. so Derby's okay. where the people want to see this is the real race this is the real race and I'm coming in injured this is oh no <laughs> if I'm coming in as like number one you're the race. underdog there's no pressure Huh? Yeah, true. <laughs> oh, this is going to be the race oh, yeah. the race. All right, stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned, please. <laughs> stay tuned. So you actually won today. People don't know it, but on the uh, results, you won this race. Did I? Well, you got a flat. You didn't have to actually like throw yourself oh, out. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I had it in the bag, easy. Like, I reckon I was on for a 3:30 or something like that. But Someone, like, one of the spectators actually told me they saw you letting your tire down outside after, after the game. <laughs> yeah, I had anxiety from how tired I was in qualifying. <laughs> didn't want to do it again. <laughs> Yeah. No, how, how, you got a flat tire right at the top. Yeah, so I actually did get a flat tire like five seconds in. Yeah. Um, probably was still like 10 or 15 psi, but yeah. can't really do too no, much of that. Work. I didn't want to break my wheel, or, like riding with a flat tire, so yeah. just cruise down and soak in the sights. Do you feel like the monkey was off your back though after getting it last year? You're kind of like, you've got that jersey on the wall now. Oh, fully. Like, <laughs> I ticked it off. Like I, People are like, oh, you want to keep the jersey? I was like, I was like not even thinking about it. Like, it it's just it? another race. Like, yeah. yeah. Um, um, but yeah, would have would have liked to put a rundown, but uh, not to be. You've got to pay your dues. And yeah, yeah. It. What's the next? Are you racing the EWS in um, next month? Yeah, I'm keen. Like, uh, Maydean is going to be sweet. Yeah. Derby will probably be sweet as well. Um, 
just good time of the good time of the bike. So looking forward to that. Because last time we raced there, you were on the podium, mate. Eh? Did you get second? To my amazing third. Oh, yeah. yeah, I actually did. Yeah, in Derby I got um, third place, and then Martin got DQ'd, oh, and then I got second. Yeah, so pretty third or second, whatever. Did Richie win that? No. Nah, Florian Nikolai. He won. Yeah. And there was two other. Who was in third or third then? Was there another Aussie guy? Huh. I can't remember. I can't remember, yeah. I remember the Aussies did real well, though. Yeah. And the whole squad's kept turning out. Jay Bart, everyone. Yeah, like the whole Dread Naughty Boys are going to be down there, so. <laughs> Dread Naughty Boys. It's going to be a fun time. Like, I'm not racing EWS, like, full-time or anything, so yeah. it's just going to be a fun fun couple of weeks. Especially doing it in Oz and tracks you know and just, like, places you know. It's going to be pretty epic. I know, especially after racing enduro in Europe where it's just, like, crippling depression. <laughs> like, these sick actual bike tracks. Yeah. Not too much up here in the stages, so. Yeah. I'm really looking forward to it. Sick. And you're racing downhill all World Cups this year, not really as much enduro overseas. Yeah, we just do the first two in Tassie, like EWS, and then, um, yeah, full World Cup, so Sick. it's going to be sweet. What are you most excited about this year? Uh, I don't know, just like we've had a full-off season on the downhill bike. I didn't get that last year. Um, so, yeah, I think just the World Cups, like, yeah. not too stoked about two qualifying sessions, but... <laughs> in one day as well, like the yeah. final. Like, I hate qualifying and now we've got to do it twice, so... That sucks, but... Yeah, I just go top five and you'd be sweet. <laughs> you have to do easy one, easy done. Yeah. Easy done. Yeah, easy. Hey, Lenzer Heights kind of your track, in a way. You've had some more high results there. Yeah, we'll see. Like, the tracks do look good this year, so... Yeah, just keep chipping away. It's still kind of, like, in the distance, like, yeah. a few months still, but... Did you... Did you find here like seeing people go so fast and you're like we've we don't stop racing till october like it's almost like build up to it a little bit more yeah the, like the level at this um cannonball just seemed gnarly like, yeah. <laughs> i was trying to count how many like world cup podiums like riders are here we're here yeah and it's almost 10 i think so yeah yeah, yeah it's, pretty it's so few heavy hitters yeah, yeah. That's sick. remember yeah. we used to come here and it was just like pretty much a club race yeah i know do you remember under 13s when we went and did the pump track and it was like you me Davey, Connor, and it was just like a few families and stuff. Yeah, and like a full point of it. Yeah, That's yeah, it's cool come a long way. Yeah, now they, now we get old, I'm like, damn, these kids have gone too fast. Like, <laughs> yeah, they don't care about. They don't have any fear. They don't have any fear. Like, I know what they were talking about when they were telling us that. Um, yeah, chill. Nah, sick. Yeah, no, nah, good times. Nah, all right, just got up. Cheers. <laughs> Now, Sammy, this is a full circle moment for me because the first time I ever met you was in Canberra and I was too scared to actually talk to you. So my mum came up and was like, oh, can you get a photo of the little guy? And I just stood there just like not saying a word, but I walked away with like the biggest smile on my face. Yeah. So, no, nah, a little bit of a story. Just made a few of them this weekend. Like, people coming up to you. Yeah, little, little dudes, it's cool. Yeah. yeah. You've had a pretty big impact on a lot of people like through the years. Like you were definitely, for me, a big motivator to be like, oh shit, Sam's doing it. Like I can try and do it. Yeah. I mean, I remember there was a time I, I think it was in three minute gaps, at the end you had this blue Troy Lee gear, yeah. and I went out and brought the same gear, yeah. and I remember I watched it, and then I went and put it on a road, and I was like, I'm Sam Hill, and I actually like channeled that, yeah. and I thought it was pretty cool, but yeah, just like, yeah, thanks for, I guess, setting the bar that high that made people want to push to be there. Yeah, well, I was a kid and used to look at the, the dudes are at the top of the time, and I'd, same, same thing, I'd watch videos and go and pretend I was Cedric yeah. Grassi or yeah. Edie or something like that, so. Because Palmer was a big influence as well, hey? Yeah, yeah, sort of, yeah, Palmer, Nico, even Sharples at, at the yeah. time when I got into mountain biking, so, yeah, I guess you look at the, the top dudes at the time and that's who you strive to be like. And yeah, yeah it's nah, cool. it's good. It's good to see you back here as well. So you're racing downhill again and you're getting stuck back into it? Yeah, we're having a, having a go, so hopefully get some World Cups and, um, yeah, yeah just, uh, it's been good. I raced Mount Buller National Round, um, raced here. I feel a lot better here than I did yeah. at Buller, so I just got to keep keep slowly building and, and try and progress the speed towards the front. Yeah, I just have to get your hands back. Back, hey, it's just bike time because I found here like I just haven't ridden enough for your hands to be strong. And you get about halfway down, your rest of your body feels good, and then your hands feel like you're an old man. So yeah, I think yeah, yesterday halfway down the seating, like you said, the hands sort of went, <laughs> yeah. felt like an anchor came out, and yeah. just survival. But yeah, keep keep um keep getting the downhill bike out and keep beating my body and 
into learning how to enjoy it coming down. Yeah, no, nah, it's good to see. And what are you most excited for this year, like when you go over to World Cups? Uh, I think the challenge is just trying to learn it all again. Yeah. Um, it's been six years since I've raced World Cups, and uh, yeah, I think a lot. The sport's definitely progressed, it's changed. So I, I need to try and adapt my training and not, not just be the same dude that I would have been six yeah. years ago. I need to try and be a modern day downhiller. Yeah, reinvent yourself again in a way. Yeah, no, it's good to see, man. It's like I saw even like from that clip you got and how hyped up that just like foot off inside. It's just like the, the man's back. So it was, yeah, it was really cool to see. It's like the style's definitely stayed around. Yeah, no, I'm feeling good. I think I got short bursts of speed. I just need to figure out how to link it all up. put it all together and sort of get that that sharp focus back. Yeah, or just putting everything in for all, all for one run. Yeah, are you gonna race the enduros in Tassie coming up soon, or are you just gonna give them a miss? Um, still not sure. Sure on those. Sure. Yeah. Just do derby, that's all I'm doing. Just do one, one and done. Uh, I feel like Maydean is the one you gotta do if you're doing one. No, I, yeah. It is good, I just don't wanna do both because I reckon I'll be worn out from one of them. Yeah, well, Maydean will be more You do Maydean, I'll do derby. Oh. Right, you get the wild card for that. <laughs> Cheers, Sammy. Oh. Cheers, man. Uh, Good looking oh. criminating. Sick. Alright, TB, how was it? What did you get? Second in Aussies and third on the day. Yeah, second Aussies. Close, well, close ish to it's gold. Close. It's a lot. It's second, so. So yeah, we're we're close, but um, a little bit disappointed. Wanted wanted the sleeve again, but um, Luke was riding really good, so it's good to see like someone else get the sleeve and, and be able to you know share it all overseas. So, but yeah, run was sick, like no complaints. We felt really strong at the bottom, fast everywhere else. So just a uh, tiny bit off the pace. I was gonna say this track. There's not many times you haven't won here, so there's like you gotta let it go now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was gonna say, what have you been seven or six or seven? It's it's been yeah a lot of a lot of cannibal races so yeah I thought I felt pretty good coming into this but um like training was really good I just didn't do heats on the downhill bike and maybe I should have maybe done a little bit more yeah it's hard hey I haven't yeah. even really run down I feel fit but like hand fitness is not there and like you get halfway and your hands go yeah exactly like quality run yesterday I was dead like yeah. I thought I was gonna pass out when I got to the bottom so yeah I think downhill fitness compared to like actual being fit is a real thing yeah and you see like Luke's obviously been here for like three weeks training and even the altitude man like it makes yeah. a big difference yeah. but I don't know if I want to be here for three weeks to then win it's like if you told me you have to be here for three weeks and you'd win I probably would just be like ah, oh, I'll, I'll take the second yeah I'll, I'll take the risk of not winning yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. but also like oh, coming off last year obviously had the injury and now you're coming out healthy so that's got to be a bit of a win as well yeah for sure like it honestly it did cross my mind a little bit I was like oh this time last year I did crash and break my ankle so yeah I kind of like had that in the back of my mind but once I was in the run it was just just full steam so yeah. I'm pretty happy with second and um, yeah we got a lot to a lot of time to work before the World yeah. Cups. That was one thing I was watching people even like Luke included going fast all week and I'm just thinking like we've got like three months before we go to a World Cup and I kind of feel like I like to build into that a little bit more and I'm just looking at these guys I'm like you got to maintain this until October I was like I don't want to peak too early. Yeah for sure I mean it's it's amazing to come and win national champs and yeah. get the sleeve and stuff but it's a long time until the season starts let alone when the season ends so yeah it's gonna be a hard one like from for me now I'm gonna pretty much drop the downhill bike and just train for um, made in EWS so I'm gonna completely change it up and do something else and then still training but then after that jump back on the downhill bike it'll be a good split for me so yeah yeah just kind of give it a little difference I guess yeah. are you just doing Maidena or you doing Maidena and Derby just Maidena I'm yeah. just doing Derby oh, oh, I know Maidena really well so I was like yeah. screw it, I'm just gonna do Maidena. Did you just get a wild card? Yeah, I, I got slid onto the enduro team real quick. <laughs> nah, I was talking to Sam, I think Sam's gonna do Maidena, maybe. Yeah. So you guys do that. I was just like, Derby's a bit more chilled, and I was like, I'll do that. But yeah. What do you mean? I haven't been to Derby since they first opened, so really? it's been a long time. Nah, it's good, man. It's, good. it's one of my favorite places. Uh, what are you most excited about for this year, like with the changes and everything happening? Is like, you excited or nervous, or how do you feel about what, like going into 2023? Yeah, I mean, I'm happy with the changes. Like, even with um, Warner Brothers and stuff coming in and then 
and kind of changing the, I guess, the race format up a little bit. Like, to be honest, it's going to suit me a fair bit. So I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, they obviously want to do better for the sport and we just got to ride the wave and see if it works. So, yeah, I think, um, I think it'll be good, but I'm pretty excited just to get back over there and really, like, push for some wins again. Sick. No, I appreciate it. Cheers, man. <laughs> right, we're here with the new under-17s national champion, Zach Bradley. How was it today, mate? Oh, mate, it was awesome. It was good? It was great. <laughs> How had, was had fun out there. How oh, was it? it was fun, and I tried to keep it smooth. <laughs> must, have, must have done something. I don't know, I had a few few little sketch, sketchy mistakes, but yeah. we got it done. Yeah. You've got this new thing, you're crashing quality, you sort your shit out, you get your shit in a pile, and then you come out and just hose everyone in finals. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, that's my secret plan, but don't tell anyone. <laughs> you're just testing the limits in quality, you find out where they are, and then you just turn it back that little bit and then nail it. Yeah, that's it. And where would you have placed today in uh, under 19? Fourth. Fourth in 19? Yeah. And what have you been like, I think 19th in elite? I oh, know, something like that. Elite oh, as no. well? Maybe. Because you put it, and this is your second year in 17, so you go up to 19 next year? Under 19 next year. Yeah. yeah. And you're ready for it? Ready. Ready for it. Super ready. <laughs> what do you reckon's changed? Because I feel like last year you were like, you were riding well, but you weren't anywhere like this, and now you've kind of separated yourself a lot, even in like the under 17s. Like, I think it was six seconds back to second, and then like another three or four back to third after that. So it's a pretty big gap. Yeah. I know. It might be like this, the new bike I got. I think that might have helped just to, just a little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> yep. And uh, had this pretty cool cool guy come along, helped me out a little, little bit. <laughs> yeah, I know, just trying to put in the, put in the effort and no, I guess it's it. working out. No, it. it was good to watch as well. We actually got to watch you run for a little bit. You look yeah. smooth with the shoot, smooth everywhere, so you're getting that flow down. Yeah. What are you excited for now? What's the next thing for you? Well, next week down and around and just, just riding. Riding's right. good. Yeah. yeah sick. <laughs> All right, cheers, Boost. Sweet. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sick. So you said you wanted to win. And we've, got, and, did it. and we've gone out and done it. We've gone out and done it. Fuck, I'm like over the moon. I like tried so hard today to like keep myself happy because I was like so nervous. Oh, we got it done. Why do you think you're so nervous? Just because you, you know I you knew could... I could win. I was yeah. like, oh, don't fuck it up. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah, like just, oh, I was like at the top and I was like, just like focus on the first corner. And once you literally hit that, you're like, okay, the rest will just flow. And I don't even remember my run. That's Except I almost had a yeah. huge. I got, I got video evidence of my huge. I like tucked the front in the chute and like pushed it so hard. I was like, I'm not letting you go. I like, pushed it and I was like, nah. And you're good. We're good, we're here. There's a big margin as well. Yeah, like four or five seconds, I think, again, on like shorter track. So that was pretty yeah, sick. So solid. I'm pumped. I'm so excited for the year ahead. So the mindset's working. The mindset is working. The yeah. chain, the chain. I'd say it's definitely working. I don't think I've had a really shit race since. So let's just keep that momentum. <laughs> well, I feel like even the thing that's like, even if you didn't get this result, you I would still like be I been all right. Yeah, I think so. Like, I definitely was like, honestly, dependent on the result. I was like, I know I'm in a good place. And then like, I knew that I'd just be like, I'm making good progress. So I was like, yeah. it's fine. But yeah, even my like, team manager messaged me. He's like, like, you turned so many heads yesterday. Like, don't worry about today. Just do yeah. you. And I did. <laughs> it's funny that whole thing when you know like you're in a good place and you're doing well and everything's working it's like you're not so focused on the result and when you're not focused yeah. on the result then it comes exactly literally I was like I yeah I wanted to win but I was like don't I didn't want to think about that my place in the start game yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I was like I actually was just having fun riding my bike so I was like I just want to enjoy this run because then I did and then you know it goes well so yeah. nah, it's, it's sick you look like you're glowing now you look like you're positive Bye. <laughs> okay, what are you doing tonight then? You to I am fire? going to win the after party. Yep. I'm so excited. I finished and I was like, fuck, I'm going to write myself off tonight. <laughs> I better celebrate. Yeah, do it. Oh, I'm so excited. I wanted it. this so bad. so And I got it. So yeah. I'm happy. No, I like it. And I get to run the sleeve for a whole year. That's there we, so oh, sick. There we go. Flexing yeah. that on TV. I like yeah. this. Yeah. And I already got it made. So I was like, I was confident. Um, I've also heard <laughs> as well, Jack's got a nickname for you because you could bench press more than any of the boys. <laughs> Jean Swanson. Yeah, shiny boy. Shiny boy. <laughs> How much did you bench? We did like a like a hold, and yeah. I did 90 kilos for my hold, and the boys were like. And I was doing their like their weight for the warm up, and they were like, "What the hell is going on?" Jackie boy, if you're out there listening to this, you need to up that. You need to up that chess game, man. You got the leg game, but the chess game is not there. We, no, even like when we were doing, it's like, "Fuck, rigs clap day." <laughs> oh, too good. All right, well, congrats, Sean. It's so good to see. Thank Cheers. You. Oh. <laughs>
I basically went off one of the gaps, forgot what it was called, just hit it wrong, hit a tree, and tree didn't, tree didn't fall over, so, yeah. Funny that.